So here's the breeding update. Things are not good. Um, I now have, we are days um, into, Pearl should have four or five hatchlings by now and she has none out of eight eggs. Um, uh, Fluffy should have two or three by now, she has none. Hyacinth should have one or two by now, she has none. I can look at the eggs and see that they are fertile or were fertile at one time. They're dark, which means there's an embryo inside of them. But for some reason they're not making it. I finally figured out what went wrong. These nest boxes that I'm using are all brand new. I used uh, different ones when I uh, bred my pets before. Brand new, brand new, untouched, even the cockatiel one. I ordered them online. Got them, yippy skippy, no diseases or anything in them. They aren't all, you know, no old leftovers because wood holds on to germs and things like that. Um, one problem, they do not have the indentation board in the bottom of the box. And I never even noticed, I never even landed on me that that's what was going on. But what happens is if they don't have that indentation, um, the eggs roll around inside the box and she may keep all those eggs collected and close to her, um, you know, for, for two weeks at a time and then one night one of those eggs will roll into a corner and she'll miss it and the embryo inside of it dies because it freezes. So basically they're, they may hatch an egg or two um, but it seems pretty unlikely at this point since I'm zero, batting an absolute zero that anything's going to hatch. And that also explains why they all laid so many eggs because they weren't getting the signs that they were viable chicks. Or they maybe they got a sign that it was a viable chick and then it went silent in there or something. Um, so what to do from here? Um, I am inclined to let the females decide to give up on these nests rather than yanking them out of the nests and throwing them back in the big cage. Um, I just think if I let them come to it on their own, um, then they'll be less traumatized by it. Um, whereas if I just pull them off a sitting nest, uh, I mean, they're still sitting on these eggs. If I just pull them out of the sitting nest and, and they, you know, have no idea what happened or why it went wrong, um, then I think I would traumatize them. So I'm just going to let them. They, they will realize that uh, also there is a distinct possibility that at least a few of these eggs might hatch. Um, uh, so we'll see, but I'm going to let it play out because I don't want, to, I want them to decide when they're done and come off the eggs and then I'll put them back in the nest box. So, and needless to say, and that's the other thing is, so this pair here, this is, um, Hedwig and Verde. Um, they're sleeping right now. Um, I put a brand new nest box on their box too. Um, I'll be taking that off and putting one of the old ones on instead. They haven't even started yet, so... Um, and that also makes me wonder if the, the pairs like these two, who are a bonded pair, but have refused to perform in any way, shape, or form, I'm wondering if she knew, hey, there's no dent in the bottom of this nest box, we can't use it, and that's why she won't do it. Um, and that goes for Sunny and the female cinnamon that, that rejected um, uh, Gray here. So we'll see. I don't know. I, I, I'm pretty sure that that's where I went wrong. Um, is I, I, it just, I never even thought about it. I just, oh boy, the new nest boxes are here and brought them out here and put them on the cages. Um, and never even really paid any attention at all. Um, so really a big bummer. Um, I have, uh, Fluffy and Sprite, Zoo and Pearl, uh, Porky and Coco, um, who's this guy, uh, Royal and Matilda, um, and Phantom and Hyacinth, so one, two, three, 
I have five really full nests and I'm just gonna wait out and let him see what happens and in the meantime with ones that I'm just getting started like these two and these two and um, for Fancy and Blue, I'm going to give them an old nest box that has a indentation in the bottom and see if they like that a little better. Okay, that's the bad news. I'll keep you posted. I may get an egg yet. I mean, I may get some babies yet, but, um, you know, I'm new at all this, and dumb mistakes will be made. Okay, bye-bye.